But anyways, I'm going to slowly start revealing the product that we have for tonight. So, um, like I said, this is an exclusive pack opening. I honestly don't even know if this is going to make it to my YouTube channel, RSR Collections, by the way. Um, just because I know with uh, Instagram recorded quality, uh, it is pretty downplayed versus uh, recording it straight onto camera phone and then to YouTube. So in this case, again, slowly revealing what we got. One so far one legacy pack so for those who don't know a legacy pack is basically an og um Yu-Gi-Oh set <laughs> that's basically been reprinted into the modern day so the reason you know that is because they're usually not first ed um yeah they're definitely usually not first ed at the same time newer konami logo in this case back in the old days this should be called magic ruler in this case, it's a spell ruler. So that's one so far. You'd be surprised how much I spent on one of these. Uh, ooh, <laughs> It's pretty close to a $50 challenge almost, if I'm being honest. <laughs> Just give me one second to increase the brightness. There you go. So we got one spell ruler. Give it another 30 seconds. Another spell ruler. <laughs> that is right. Another spell ruler. So that's two. Um, the reason why I say this is almost a $50 challenge is because these were eleven ninety two dollars each at my local Walmart. <laughs> now, I just got to make a low-key rant here before I start opening these packs. So... For anyone who will be watching this or if does understand the idea of, um, I guess, just you YouTubing or in this case, even just, you know, trying to vlog inside public places like Walmarts and stuff like that. <laughs> I went to the Garden City one, guys. I, I honestly thought going, you know, within the last hour was going to be, you know, more low key, probably a lot, you know, less people, meaning less, again, awkwardness in terms of, you know, just trying to commentate on what I'm trying to find there. <laughs> I'll tell you one thing. I didn't draw a public crowd, but I drew a crowd of employees thinking that I'm going to be um <laughs> thinking that I was like stealing or something. <laughs> Probably because there was like there's one of these packs that were like unpackaged and just like chilling. Um like like all like there's like nine cards, right? They're just scattered on the shelves. And I found the super rare. I was like going through it just to see if they took the hollow card and they didn't for whatever reason. And I was low key gonna take it, but I'm like Man, these guys are low-key judging me, so I'm going to just put it back. Um, yeah, I, I don't know how Team Sam, I don't know how Team APS does it. I don't know if, if Walmarts are just different in other provinces or in this case in the States, but they make it look so easy to get away with recording, um, I don't know, like recording like videos or like live streaming or whatever they do um, to get their content up. In this case, uh, here, let's reveal another product for tonight. We got Pharaoh's Servant. So we'll see how this goes. You got Pharaoh's Servant. I have one more legacy pack. No, it is not on LOB, unfortunately. And last but not least, another spell ruler. So four legacy packs, guys. Um, this is just too hot. Like, man, I, I understand they're 12 bucks a piece, but like, I don't think I'm ever going to find this many legacy packs in one Walmart ever again. <laughs> uh, unless I really try. Uh, these are the last four legacy packs. They had like newer sets. Well, I say newer, but like maybe like three years old uh, going into um, into these blisters and they're calling it a legacy pack. But I'm like, no, nah, man, they're not legacy packs. I think it's like Dimension of Chaos or something. But in this case, we got four legacy packs. Probably the most I've, I've personally bought in one purchase. Uh, we're going to get started very, very soon. Um, now there's a reason why I specifically chose this playmat as the background. And from my understanding, Pokemon Shining, what is it called? Shining Fates? Fates Shining? Shining Fates? I don't, I don't know. I heard that release and I understand the hype. I'm starting to slowly understand the hype of Pokemon cards. I, I tried guys. I really tried to pick up, um, something. I really tried to pick up, um, 
a um like a, a box is that what you call it a box or a few packs of shining fates sold out man <laughs> so i decided to backtrack and just test my luck now a lot of these a lot of you guys that i follow have had some luck hopefully these god hands will be with me today we got one champion's path so this was the previous set before shining fates so let's go see what we actually do end up pulling out of this um i'm pretty excited very very excited considering how again like i haven't bought pokemon product in so long if i'm being honest so let's get started guys but before we do i just gotta take a quick thumbnail because i always forget to do these things <laughs> uh hold on give me one sec always forget to do these things so let's see what can we do for a thumbnail here we'll just probably do the two legacy packs or i don't know <laughs> sure good enough here we go i might even turn on flash while i'm at it and one without All right, so let's get started with these legacy pack guys. Um, we'll again, we'll see how this goes. I probably spent. I'm not gonna declare a fifty dollar, hundred dollar challenge. I spent probably like eighty bucks, give or take. Um, these four alone is pretty much a fifty dollar challenge, and I don't want to declare anything. <laughs> but if we do pull something pretty minty, this will this will be very exciting. So let's get started. We'll go with the spell ruler. Let's go. Um, right here. Also, I know I did say I was going to do this on Twitch. Fortunately, I don't have a second tripod and I I, I don't really have anything else to use. <laughs> so, unfortunately, it's just going to be IG Live for now. I'll probably end up buying another like tripod or something and we're going to end up doing both. So, I want to hide our extra promo cards, if you will. So, one spell ruler. So, you promised two rare cards, huh? And what? Two, two rare cards and eight commons. So, one of them is a green gadget. F-I-G-A. Is this Fist of Gadgets? This Fist of Gadgets? Super rare first edition. Uh, we got Noble Arms, Vampire Retainer. I guess we'll just do it this way. Vampire Retainer, The Revenge of the Normal, Mystric uh, Huddler, Dino Wrestler, Capitera, Glad Beast, Dra <laughs> Dragasses, and a Dino Wrestler, Caparaptor, and a Boy Cotton. So... Walmart, where the hell are... Where's our second rare card, though? 1, 2, 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9. Man, we got gypped again by Walmart. Nine cards? They only... Yeah, what? Guys, eight commons, two rares. That equals, what, ten cards? Definitely more than I can count. <laughs> but we only got nine cards. 1, 2, let's... Well, that's 3, 4, 5, 6, 7, 8, 9... We got, guys, we got, we got gypped. j -Rack the Collector, what's up, man? <laughs> we got gypped. Oh, man. I am curious, though. Mega Pack 19. So, <laughs> these commons are all from the Mega, like, Mega Pack 19. Wow. I can't believe we got gypped. Um, hmm. Well, let's get started here, guys. So, we got a green gadget. Super rare. Uh, let's go. Spell Ruler. Since I have y'all's attention, I will set with this pack opening, I will send you guys to the Shadow Realm, regardless if I got gypped. <laughs> All right, we got, okay, so these are non-first dead. So we got Guardian of the, of the Throne Room, House of Adhesive Tape. Yo, are these cards even real? <laughs> House of Adhesive Tape. <laughs> Queen Bird. Oh, a super rare Banisher of the Light. I'll take that. A super rare in a, in a legacy pack. And a rare Senju of the Thousand Hands. Okay, okay. Toll. <laughs> Gaia Power, I remember this. And Ceremonial Bell and Wall Shadow. Yeah, Yo, you see that? Wall Shadow. Shadow Realm. That's where y'all are going. 
Next pack. Spell ruler. All right. Man, Walmart, I can't believe we got gypped again. Oops. Y'all didn't see that. <laughs> Y'all did not see that. <laughs> oh boy. Let me just pick up these cards, guys. Well, on the bright side... <laughs> oh yeah, you keep waiting. On the bright side, I didn't spoil our two hollows, But... Um, Let's just go through these some of the our eight commons again. So we got Vampire Awakening, Goki Pole, Limit Code, The Deep Grave. Huh. Interesting. Trickstar Defin De Delphinium. <laughs> Galaxy Celeric. FA Dead Heat. Trickstar Bokeh. So so far these commons are for them the are from the 2019 Megatin, Gold Sark Tin. Our first rare card is We've got a super herald of the abyss sofu s-o-f-u sofu who i actually don't even know and then the next one is Som summer summoner Som summer summoner s-o what set is this guys somebody let me know actually i actually don't even know um all right so let's get started spell ruler All right, we got Guardian of the Throne Room, Mystic Plasma Zone, Red Archery Girl. Ah, okay, that makes sense. Soul Fusion. I've never opened one, so there you go. Um, doesn't this look like Toon Mermaid? Ah, whatever. Crab Turtle and a Rare UFO Turtle. Okay. So no Hollow there. Eternal Rest, Course of the Sanctuary, and Final Destiny, Molten Destruction. All right, at least we, we didn't get gypped there. Hey, it's Jinzo. What's going on? What's going on? All right, let's switch it up to Pharaoh Servant. Hey, hey, my man. So let's switch up to Pharaoh Servant. Um, again, I last time, disclosure here, last time I've opened probably some of these legacy packs was when I first got LC01 when that first came out about, what is that now, eight years ago maybe? And that was probably from Can Central. So... That's probably the last time I opened these legacy packs, and I didn't even understand at the time the value of a legacy pack. <laughs> so I'm trying my best to not spoil our two rares and eight commons, assuming that is what we get. <laughs> well then. <laughs> Alright, so Pharaoh Servant, what do we got for our cards here? We got a super rare battle Cruiser Di Diantis. Kanamali Mud Golem. Uh, N-U-M-H. So, num number number hunters? Numeron hunters? <laughs> and then... Oh, okay. So we got different commons this time. So we got FA Circuit Grand Prix. Dark World Brainwashing. Predator Plant Bank Psyogre. Gravity Lash. Unchained Twins. Um, some Sarma? Sarama? This is from Eternity Code this time, too, this common. Uh, Trias Hierarchia. AIQ. IQ. You, you acute? Just kidding. <laughs> and a super heavy Samurai Wagon. Okay, so the commons are from what? Eternity Code and CO, COT, COTD. Control of the Duelist. <laughs> code, of the, code of the Duelist. There you go. There you go. I got that one. Code of the Duelist. Okay. Uh, where'd I put that pack? Okay, so Pharaoh Servant. Let's go. No LOB packs, unfortunately. No Metal Raiders, no LOB. Alright. We got Steel Ogre Gr Gr Grotto, number two. Harpy's Brother. Hey, there you go. I mean, Harpy's support just came out, so. Attack to Receive. Mr. Volcano. And a rare Morphing Jar, number two. Isn't this banned? <laughs> uh new numinous healer thousand eyes idol mystic probe four starred ladybug of doom it's okay y'all will still go to the shadow realm just trust just trust we got we got one hollow out of those legacy packs okay so so far that's three legacy packs 
We're on to our last legacy pack. Magic spell rulers. Spell magic rulers. Spell rulers. <laughs> Come on. Never spending 12 bucks on these ever again, man. No, there wasn't actually any uh, any Invasion of Chaos um, uh, array. So uh, when I went over there, um, I, I don't know if you were still here. For, you're, I don't know if you were here in the beginning of um, when I started here, but I kind of explained basically what went down when I went to Walmart. So I basically tried to pull off, you know, like a Team Sam, like Team APS, you know, kind of style where I go on IG Live or, you know, whatever, just record myself, just going through packs, right? And um, my honest thought was doing it after, like close to close was, a, you know, was smart, right? Because... Not a lot of public, meaning you don't attract um, you don't attract a lot of attention. I'll tell you one thing: the attention I did attract <laughs> were the employees. <laughs> they thought I was stealing. <laughs> uh, and there was a Phantom Rage blister that somebody opened up, tore apart, and just left all the card. No, sorry, Gen Impact blister, and just let the cards be. And they didn't even take the super rare. It's like they literally opened it just to see what what they get, and then they just dipped. Um, I went through the box of the of what they call legacy packs. All they had was, yeah, these were literally it. And then they also had, um, they had a bunch of Phantom Rage blisters, return, uh, Phantom Rage, Gen Impact. They already have Blazing Vortex. I don't know if you guys know, but they have Blazing Vortex blisters already. But again, it was just, it was just so funny, man. They were eyeing me like I was stealing. <laughs> Anyways, our first rare card in this blister is, uh, Raster, Raster Liger, super rare. F-I-G-A, whatever that means. And, oh, okay, our first ultra rare, Twilight Ninja Kagan, 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 BLLR, Battles a Legend, no, BLLR, ba Battles a Legend, ah, fuck, I, I don't even remember, <laughs> anyways, <laughs> Water Hazard, Ritual of Destruction, Ritual of Grace, Verdant Sanctuary, Spirit Burner, Unleash Your Power, Gladiator, um, Proving Ground, and Vicious Claw. Um, yeah, I, I wish. I wish I could pull a Jinzo. <laughs> Light's Revenge. Thank you. That was a legend, Light's Revenge. Um, these commons, though, are a little bit older. Yeah, these commons are a little bit older, guys. PTDN, Power of the Duelist. Um, ANPR, I'm pretty sure that's Ancient Prophecy, no? CRMS, Crimson Crisis, SOVR, I don't remember that one. ABPF is Abyss something. And then another Ancient Prophecy. So, wow, uh, that last Legacy pack, we actually have an assortment of comments from different, um, literally older sets. So, that's always good. Um, okay, here we go. Spell Ruler. Last pack, last Legacy pack of Destiny. We got Mystic Plasma Zone, Hungry Burger. Okay, well, Phantom Darkness. Thank you. <laughs> uh, Late Labyrinth Wall, the Maze Runner, Curse of Fiend, Absolute Power Force. Thank you. Okay, yeah. So definitely older packs. Um, Curse of Fiend. Oh, just a rare. Send you the Thousand Hands. Eternal Rest, Performance of Sword, I remember this card. Twin Long Rods, number two. <laughs> and uh, Boar Soldier. All right, I mean, hmm, it's okay. There's still a chance to get sent to the Shadow Realm, okay, guys? <laughs> that is it for the Legacy Packs. If anything, our highlight out of the four. <laughs> Thanks a lot. <laughs> is the Banisher of Light. So at least we pulled a haul out of the of today's legacy pack. So what, one in four? And then we got shortchanged from Walmart with these damn um, uh, legacy blister packs. But these are the promo cards, the rares that they promised. Uh, two, four, six. We're short one card basically. Uh, Green gadget's pretty cool though. We'll go with legacy with to go with the legacy packs. And then our rares, right? Nothing, nothing crazy. All right, so we'll leave that there. Um, let's move on to the next and last box or pack. Um, there's a reason why this mat is out, guys. There's a reason why. Repeat it once again. I heard Shining Fates came out yesterday. I understand. That I'm starting to understand the tr uh, the trend of the of these Pokemon cards. So 
I figured, why not? Let's go in for a Champions Path. Previous set in Pokemon, I'm uh, from my understanding. Um, tried to buy some. I tried to buy this and Shining Fates, but um, they're sold out, man, everywhere. Uh, so eventually, I gave up and I just decided to settle for the Legacy Packs on Walmart. But you know, figured I would test our luck here. Um, Thirty nine ninety nine retail. Um, they did have a Shining Fates in this box, but it was fifty nine ninety nine, and you're basically paying the way. This is the way I see it. I, I don't know if you guys know better. The way that I see it is you're paying an extra. This is sixty bucks, right? You're paying an extra twenty dollars from what this should cost to get this jumbo sized Pikachu card, and then a what do they call this? A GX or EX, whatever they call it, Pikachu, and that's what you're paying an extra twenty dollars for. So I didn't think it was worth it at that point. I'd be spending a hundred bucks, and yeah, I just didn't think it was worth it. Um, the other ones that they had, like the Dene, was the one I was going for. That was forty five from Fusion, but unfortunately they don't have them, right? So um, again. We'll test our luck. We'll see how this goes. There's still a chance. Okay, there's still a chance. How the hell do you open these? Uh, <laughs> Here, give me one sec. All right. Come on. There you go. So, interesting. Okay, okay. So you're telling me each pack is 10 bucks each if this is $40. Digimon unboxing when? Good question. Good question. I don't know. <laughs> I probably won't. Um, if I'm being honest, I wasn't really into Digimon back in the day. <gasps> yeah, I know. I Unfortunately, that was one of the very few shows and cards and toys that I just never got into, if I'm, if I'm being completely honest. All right. Um, okay, I mean, they keep your promo card nice and sealed. Better than anything Konami's done. Let's see here. So there you go. Our ha Hatterene. Yeah, Hatterene. It's pretty cool, actually. They feel nice, too. <laughs> All right. So we got a jumbo card. I I, I don't even know what I'm going to do with this. Give it away, maybe? Give it away with my field, with uh, Blazing Vortex Field Center? <laughs> uh, I have no use for this. Maybe a bookmark? <laughs> Let's actually put this to the side. All right, so one, two, three, four packs. If I'm being honest, guys, the only Pokemon packs... Here, you know what? Go, use it now. Use it now. Use it now. Screenshot this. I'm not going to use it, guys. Fusion's selling this for 25 cents, okay? Just use this now. Screenshot it. Send to your friends. I don't, I don't care. Just take it. I'm not going to use it. Five seconds. And one. <laughs> Uh, where was I going with this? Um, that's right. So <laughs> the only the last time I've opened Pokemon packs, the first and only time I've opened Pokemon packs is when Detective Pikachu came out. And when you went into, I think I watched that Silver City, like, well, Scotia Bank Theater, sorry, Apollo. And they were giving you, I think they were giving away uh, a, two promo cards. And then you got two of the uh, Pokemon uh, movie packs, I guess, right? Yeah, movie packs. So that was the la first and last time I've, I've opened um, Pokemon packs. Um, I saw, I know Dollar Tree carries these. Maybe one day we'll, I'll rate them and see what we get. But, um, without further ado, guys, let's get started. Four packs, Champion's Path. What are we looking at here for that Charizard, I think? <laughs> uh, oh boy. Heart Cycle is not one of the Digi Destiny. Yeah, well, yeah, you're not wrong. <laughs> All right. We got a Rock Ruff. A per loyan, a linium, linium, right? What the hell is this? Uh, sizzly, sizzly peed, sizzly ped. Oops. Uh, Hatina, Sharpedo, suspicious food tin, <laughs> energy card, Milo, great ball, Absol, and a trainer card. Really? Wasn't there anything? Wasn't there anything like? Ah, oh, whatever. I don't know. Suspicious food tin is, I guess, the best one out of the out of the out of the set or out of that pack. Use it now. Use it now. Screenshot it. Go. Use it now. That was your rare guy. Ah, okay. Yeah, I figured. All right. Next pack of Destiny. Oh boy. 
Gold rare is a secret rare. Wait, so this is called a gold rare? Or... Uh, I don't know. I'll, I'll eventually understand this. <laughs> uh, we got a Weedle. A Kakuna. A Carvana. A Potion. A Vulpix. A Pokeball. A Lycanroc. An Energy Card. Suspicious Food Tin. Nice. Sonya. Who the hell are you? A Lyperd. And that was it. Use it. Use it. Come on. Screenshot it. Take it. I'm not using it. <laughs> so, what? So, like, are you telling me we didn't pull a good card in this? Or, like, the, like an Ultra Rare or whatever? Or does it say SV or something in one of the corners? Uh. No? I mean, I'll let you be the judge. <laughs> Um, anyways, so that's disappointing. All right, next pack. Man, I, I don't even think we made our value back whatsoever. <laughs> uh, so, okay, hold on here. Before I get to this, this, this pack, between the, between the, the four legacy packs and um, the champion's path, this is literally about $80 with the product. Got a potion, Linoon. Oh come on, a uh, Nicket, Machop, an Ekans, Hop. Uh, okay. Uh, Ob Obstagoon, Obst Obstagoon. It ain't worth uh, the bottom right eighty out of seventy three, so it's above the base at seventy three. Sure, whatever that means. <laughs> yeah, eighty out of seventy three. Yeah, 80 out of 73. Energy card, Team Yelgrunt, Machoke, and a Trainer card. Go ahead. Go ahead, take it. Last pack. La very, very last pack. I don't think I'm buying Pokemon cards ever again. <laughs> kind of sad now. You spent 40 bucks to get nothing. <laughs> All right. Got a Roly Coley, Zig, Zigzagoon. Got a Weedle, Perloyan, Pokeball, Kaboo, Professor's Research, Energy Card, uh, Hatram, Sonia, Beedrill, and pretty much nothing else. Oh no. Oh well. I spent 150 so it's the ri I mean, that's fair, I guess. <laughs> oh, yeah. Scan it. Take it. Whatever you got to do. Whatever you want to do with this. Well, that wraps it up, guys. I was tempted, though. Um, they did have... They had four boxes left over of Shining Fates. Like, um, I think you said you spent 150 for the box. Um, that's I'm assuming that's the Elite Trainer box. They had uh, four more left over of Fusion, but they were going for 180 So, I figured that was too steep, man. <laughs> um, yeah. Anyways... Uh, <laughs> looks like he, yeah, 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 okay, well, you know what, I'll get out of the hole, okay, this is 80 bucks, I'll, I'll make the value back somehow, <laughs> we'll, we'll, we'll find something else to, to bury myself in, um, this is kind of cool though, let's appreciate this real quick, this is, this is kind of cool, suspicious food tin, oh, well, it is what it is, uh, guys, RSR collections here, spent $80 with a sealed product, Maybe, I, you know, maybe we'll do something again soon. I don't know. OTS 15, I kind of want to try out. Um, we'll see what happens. <laughs> I'm kind of I'm, I'm kind of sad. I'm not going to lie. All right, guys. RSR here from RSR Collections. Signing off. Thank you for joining my first uh, IG live um, pack openings. Right? Yeah? Cool. Deuces, guys. <laughs>